Hey guys, welcome to another episode of my channel. So today I'm going to teach you how to create and edit ISO files on your Linux system. And for the purpose of this episode, I have uh, one empty directory and I'm going to create two simple uh, textual files with command echo that I'm going to store in one file and another one. All right. Now, if you want to create ISO file that is going to contain these two files, we need another app named Brasero. And if you don't have that app installed, please install it. I'm going to open it right now. And in project, I'm going to create a new project, new data project. And I'm going to add these two files to this project. Now, in this uh, first text box, I'm going to uh, name this drive. Actually, here you're going to uh, write a name that you want your ISO file to have when it's mounted. So when I mount this file, it's going to be shown in this list. And it's going to be named with text that we put in here. So I'm going to call it my disk. Now I'm going to uh, click on burn and I'm going to navigate when I want to uh, store this ISO file in same directory uh, where I have uh, these two files. So I'm just going to uh, name it my underscore disk and I'm going to click on create image. All right, we have it. As you can see in here, I have uh, my disk dot ISO. And when I double click on it, I'm going to have uh, my disk in this list. And when I click on it, I'm going to see this content. This is content that we just created and it is stored in our ISO file. All right. But now if you want to edit this content, you cannot do it from here because ISO file is read only. What you can do, you can extract this file because ISO is nothing but an archive. Then you can make changes that you like. And finally, you can create another ISO file that contains that upgraded content. So I'm going to navigate back. I'm going to delete these two files, all right, and I'm going to unmount this image. All right, now right click on uh, my disk ISO and I'm going to click on extract here. And I got this message because uh, names of these files are probably still hashed, so I'm going to click on replace all. And we have our two files extracted. And sometimes after extraction, these two files are going to come with limited privileges. In order to deal with that, what you can do, you can use command sudo change mode to 707 to everything with extension of txt and provide your password. All right, that is going to solve that problem. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to uh, create another file for example, with four zeros, and I'm going to name it third. All right, we can also edit some of this content now. So I'm going to change this into bunch of zeros, save it, everything's fine. And now I'm going to create updated ISO files. So first I'm going to delete this one. I'm going to open Bracero once again new project, new data project. Of course, I'm going to add these two files. Call it however you like. And burn it again. Name it updated ISO and create image. Wonderful. Now I'm going to delete these three files and I'm going to mount my updated ISO. Of course, my updated uh, ISO disk, it's uh, text that is used. And we have our three files. Let's check this content. Voila. So guys, that's all for this episode. I hope that you learned something new, something interesting. So please like, subscribe and see ya.